Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Anti-Gravity Room. Today we have a box of Star Wars Destiny Awakening Set Booster Box ready for opening. Right now we're going to open it up. There's, If you hear some whistling, there's a little bastard kid next door who's just whistling non-fucking-stop. So you might hear that throughout the video. Like, unfortunately, I don't think it's socially acceptable for you to go over there and punch him in the face. But we just have to deal with a little bit of whistling here and there. Let's get this thing cracked open. We got this actually at our local store, Phoenix Rising, for 100 bucks. Pretty good price considering some people are selling these for like 10 bucks a pack online. It's ridiculous. Just wait for a restock. Fantasy Flight will restock them. They just take their sweet time as all their shit comes from China and takes months and months to restock. Alrighty. We got this cellophane off of here. Alright. There's tape on here now too, for Christ's sakes. Got mine off. Oh, oh, Lexi got hers too. Boom. All right. I'm gonna start off with the pack. And Lex will go. So once again, the second run of these actually doesn't have the dice locked in place like it's supposed yeah, to. Okay. So, but our first pack of the day, we got. Who do we have here? Leia Organa, it looks like to me, once the thing actually decides to focus in. <laughs> Very cool. Oh, that's, that's actually kind of cool. She's a rare Princess Leia. 11 cost. And you can remove this die to reroll up to two of your die. And her die isn't bad. She does have a blank, but not bad. And she's 12 or 16, depending on if you want to play her with one or two dice. And then we also got Duggan. Jedi Temple. Probe and disarm. All right, Lexi, you can go ahead and open okay. yours, and I'll just recap whatever you're opening. Yeah. Okay. So let's, put that let's check out her dice. So I have ooh Darth Vader. That looks like Vader to me. Did she pull the legendary Vader on the first fucking pack? That's crazy if she did. Oh my god, she oh pulled my god. first pack, Darth <laughs> oh. Vader, Legendary Sith Lord, holy fuck, right away, you, she pulled like one of the best cards in the set. So there you go, check out his dice, 13 health, crazy dice, after you activate this character, you may force an opponent to choose and discard a card from their hand right away, 16 or 21, fucking crazy Lex, first pack, you are welcome, four strike, enrage, firepower, and hit and run. Very cool pack. Yeah. Very cool pack. Liam right. wants to open up a pack. I want to select one myself. He's going to select his own pack. All right. Well, All while right. he selects and gets ready to figure out how to open this, I'm going to go to the next <laughs> pack. All right. It looks like I got some sort of Jedi doing a deflect or something. Let's see what this is. And the card that matches up is called Force Protection, and it's an upgrade. Blue character only. Give three shields to characters distributed as you wish. It's got some kind of okay dice. Got a couple extra four symbols in there. It's a trap. Surgical strike. Arm to the teeth. And field medic. Is it Akbar? Is that like the character? What did you say? Yeah, it it's a trap. Oh. No, it's just the card. All right. We have turn. Try and open it over here so we can see it, Liam. Atta boy. What do we got? We have a lot of mess. What dice did you get? A stick. It looks like <laughs> Ray's staff, which we pulled in a previous video. Oh, boo. I'm not good at this. Here are the cards. William's pack kind of fell apart there, but he got a raised staff for his rare. Remove a die, showing damage, melee, or gun. Occupation, Emperor's Throne Room, Surgical Strike, and go for the kill. Very cool, very cool. My turn. Lexi's turn next. My turn. <laughs> she got her pack. I'm all excited now. <laughs> okay, so for the dice, I have another Vader, I think. But no. it's like a bigger picture of him? Who is that? That is Vader, but it's definitely not the character die this time. It's some sort of upgrade, I believe. Oh, man. Force choke upgrade ability. Very cool. Someone's building a Vader deck. <laughs> Blue character, deal only. 
Deal one unblockable damage to another character, then you may turn one of its character <coughs> die or upgrade to any side so you can, Oh, that's pretty good. And that's also a legendary. Oh, shit. Hey, Lexi's pulled two legendaries yeah. in both her packs. We couldn't Yay. pull one legendary in ten packs <laughs> last time. That's crazy. So, Force Choke. Another legendary. And then we also got Resistance HQ. Sweep the area. Deflect. And defensive stance. Cool. Very nice. Alright, I'll go again. Alright, what do I have here? I think I got a Luke Skywalker. No way, another Ooh. legendary? This box is killer if this is Luke. It is, it's legendary fucking Luke. Holy shit, we got Luke and Vader in like the first six packs. We didn't even have to open any more packs from this box. This is crazy. We will, though. <laughs> Luke Skywalker, Jedi Knight. After you activate this character, draw a card. Fuck yeah. 12 health, 15 to field, or 20 with two dice. Pretty decent dice. He's definitely not nearly as good as Vader, but he's still, he's a legendary, so. Prize possession. The Force is strong. I like that card art a lot. Drudge work. And patience. Good. Very cool. That is a cool one. It's cool to card. see cool art of Yoda, yeah. like, looking all mystical. That. Look at that. Do you want to open a, another yeah, pack, Liam? For sure. I'm going to go deep. Hopefully I don't get another I'm gonna go gray deep. card. <laughs> I'm going to go deep. She's the worst. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, I'm not a fan of Ray either. He's got it. I think he's got it. <laughs> I got. Let's see the dice. The dice he pulled is a calm link. I'm pretty sure Lando. Oh man, that's a good card though. Calm link. I actually like this card a lot. It's an upgrade equipment. After you play this upgrade, you can reroll any number of dice or any number of your opponent's dice. Pretty cool. And then he also got a hyperspace jump, a disturbance in the force, a power of the force. Good card, and a disarm. Lex, you're the expert pack it. opener, so let's let's see what you're going. This time, I don't even know. I see some stormtroopers in the back. It looks like some sort of spy. It's definitely a bounty hunter or scum. Infiltrate. She got an infiltrate upgrade ability for yellow, and you could reroll up to two of your opponents die. My hand's kind of covering the dice. There you go, there's the sides of the dice. And it's a one cost. And she also pulled Endless Ranks. I like this card a lot too. Cannon Fodder. This is one of my favorite card arts in the set. The battle droid just getting destroyed. <laughs> Lying in wait. And block. Not a great card. Alright. Some sort of scum card again. I don't know what that is. But we will see. It is Hired Gun. So just a regular old Bounty Hunter 9 health, 8 to field, and there's its dice. His dice aren't super bad, but they have to take a resource, which is kind of shit. And he's just vanilla. He has no extra effect. They got Underworld Connections, Scavenge, Award Ceremony, and Dodge. Dip, duck, dive, and dodge. The three D's of Star Wars Destiny. All <laughs> by, right. by three, I mean four. Yeah. See what you grabbed. Probably some more Bantha fodder. <laughs> <laughs> I get it. That's a little Star Wars joke for you guys. Is there a drink around here? Oh, no. Okay. Liam really likes to throw these cards on the ground. <laughs> He's like, oh, they're worth a lot of money, but I'm going to throw them on the ground repeatedly. <laughs> okay. I got a something. Rebel. Looks like a rebel soldier or a rebel captain. Yeah. Rebel trooper. What's it called? Scavenge. No, no, no. The rebel trooper. The rebel is trooper the rare. It's is. usually in the front if you don't drop the pack. <laughs> it is a rebel trooper. All right. There you go. So Liam pulled a rebel <laughs> trooper. Guardian. Before you activate this character, you may resolve an opponent's die, showing damage against it. That's pretty neat. 
And he also pulled Leadership, Scavenge, Boundless Ambition. I like that fucking card art a lot too, Christopher Lee. And Defensive Position. Oh, nice. Turn. Lex's turn. <laughs> we all like opening this game. It makes us giddy. I don't. <laughs> we, have, we have pulled some shitty pulls, but. Okay, so I That's have. That's not the game's full. I have someone. It looks like um the uh, the toilet guy who has Java is back. I can't remember his name. Oh, with a long yeah, long, long thing. Ears. He still doesn't have a name on here, no, but it's cunning. it's cunning. It's an upgrade <laughs> ability. Resolve a special ability on another card and play it as if it were your card. That's kind of cool. He's creepy. Biff Fortuna or Bib Fortuna. That's his name. Oh, okay. Noble <clears throat> sacrifice. Obi Wan putting up his lightsaber to die. Intimidate I like that with Darth Maul there, and he doesn't like you. I love the names of these. Yeah. I don't like you either. Alright. Another pull. What's Jiffy gonna pull? Looks like Jiffy's gonna pull Han Solo's blaster. Oh, come on. <laughs> I think that's what it is. I think it's a DH. It is. It's a DH-17 blaster. Upgrade. Just a simple upgrade dice weapon. It doesn't have any side effect. Kind of a simple card. All in. Oh, six. Sabine and Ezra. I love seeing some go. rebel stuff on here. Hunker down. Street informants. And closing the net. Excellent. Liam. Let's get some legendaries going here. Sorry, guys. <laughs> drum rolling. Hey, drum roll. <laughs> you can barely hear it. <laughs> drum roll on the legendaries. It's blue. It's I don't blue. Know what that means. Blue. <laughs> That's just oh, the... Obi Wan. Oh, it looks That's like Obi. an Obi Wan. It could be a Force die though, or it's an Fuck. upgrade. One with the Force, yeah. That's right. a good upgrade though. It's a legendary upgrade that you pulled, and it's pretty decent. Blue characters only. It's got no blank die, which is the best thing about it. And before attached to, before attached character is defeated, this upgrade becomes support for the rest of the game. It starts ready. Pretty good card, not bad at all. It's four costs, it's kind of high for what it is, but it's still pretty solid. Nice pull. Good job. All right. So we got a gray dice, which means it's another staff. It's another race staff again. We're gonna have so many fucking race staffs. So I'm assuming the cards She's are the, the same then? That's the card, race staff. We literally pulled three of these in a box and 10 packs. Which kind of sucks. Most likely spaceport, firepower, and occupation. As you know, you can only have two copies of anything in your deck, so once you pull a third copy, it's kind of not good. <laughs> what did I get here? It looks like I opened a Death Star Trooper? Or pilot, or engineer, I guess. I don't know what you would call them. You would call them General Veers. A field commander. Action. Remove this die to turn one of your support die to any side. Which is not bad. And then I got Emperor's Favor. Don't get cocky. Isolation. And logistics. Wait. Yeah. Okay. This is the die. Alright, so Liam got, it looks like a sniper gun of sorts. And it is the IQ-8-2 blaster. IQ-8-11 blaster. Or maybe it's 2. No, it's 11. I'm going to say 11. Deal 2 unblockable damage to a character. That's pretty cool. Flank. I like this card a lot. Rebel War Room. Street informants and another dodge, which isn't that great. <clears throat> all right. All right, I got. These kids are all opening packs. Jeffrey doesn't get to open any packs. Jeffrey gets skipped three times. Jeffrey gets skipped three times. That's not true. He only got skipped once. But that's intolerable. We got a <laughs> second Leia Organa die, so we can play two now. If he did want to fielder it too. 
but you're starting to get some rare doubles. Cannon fodder again, I like that. Personal escort, I like those too. Royal guards are awesome and reposit. All right. Now it's my turn. Now go ahead, Lexi. <laughs> Liam's phone's going off like a fucking fiend. I believe right. I got Boba. No, I think you got Boba's jetpack, but that would be sweet if you got Boba Fett. But it looks like it's central around the jetpack. Yeah, pack I got the jetpack. Yeah. I'm pulling Han Solo. That's my Upgrade goal. equipment. He's a legendary. He's hard to get. No. Force strike, smuggling, intimidate, and draw attention. I actually like this card too. Finn with the lightsaber. It's pretty dope. All right. So that's, what now, 6, 12, that's half the box now, we're at the halfway point. Alright, it looks like I got some sort of commendation or upgrade. Promotion. Red character, after you play this card you may draw a card, pretty solid for one. There's its die. Then we got Tactical Mastery, Enrage, Probe, Field Medic, Liam. Got a nice split of red, yellow, and blue dice this time, though. Yeah, we need a couple more grays, maybe. Well, the grays here are colorless, yellow. Or neutral, so it's okay. Uh, Django? Oh, it looks like he pulled a Django Fett. That does look like it might be Django. I'll tell you in two seconds. Django's a solid pull. It is... Definitely Django Fett. Definitely Django Fett. Pretty solid pull. Yeah. Not the better of the Fets, but yeah, I'll take still it. not bad. Yeah, we'll take it. After an opponent activates a character, you may activate this character. It's nice to see some prequel stuff. Fantasy Flight really doesn't like the prequels as much, so it's nice to see a little bit of it here and there. Even though Django is a douche. <laughs> the sign of things to there. come. Sign of things to come. Okay, so this one. We have... It looks like a TIE Fighter to me. And it is, I'm pretty sure. I was going to say that, but I didn't want to be wrong. I just don't know if it's a First Order or an OT TIE Fighter. First Order. First tie. Order TIE Fighter. So I'm not sure. I think you might get one of these in the Kylo Ren pack. But it's got solid die. Costs three to field. And you remove all shields from all of opponent's characters. Second chance. Imperial Armory. That's cool looking with all the grenades and rifles. Arm to the teeth, and he doesn't like you. <laughs> All right. I'll die. Do we get here? First order stormtrooper. I can get my 4K stormtrooper duck going soon. Just need one more stormtrooper. I'll have four of them. So, as you know, stormtrooper, it's a swarmy deck. It only costs seven to field. It's got mediocre die, but you can just upgrade the shit out of all four of them and just run a swarm deck with a bunch of stormtroopers. Liam. Get a legendary. <clears throat> oh, sorry. Did you get BB-8? Yeah, I think you got a BB-8. BB-8's yeah, BB BB not bad. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, it is. He's got BB-8. Reroll this die and one of your other die. Do not remove this die from your pool after resolving the ability. Pretty solid. <clears throat> it's got retreat, most icely spaceport, unpredictable, and feel your anger. <coughs> All right. It's so, Lexi grabbing here. I can't really tell what that is. That is some sort of force choke or push or red redness coming off of a hand. That's Kylo Ren, is it not? Yeah, I believe it might be. Immobilize. No, it's just a random Sith. Blue characters only. Remove this die to turn a die to a show, to a side showing blank. So you can just move somebody to a blank. Mind trick. I like this card already again. The force is strong. Unpredictable and patience. All right. No one wants to pull legendaries anymore. It's up to me. Legendary. Count Dooku! I don't know if he's legendary, but he's dope. <laughs> <laughs> I like Dooku. Count Dooku. 
Count Dooku. I like Christopher Lee. Saruman. For this character is dealt one or more damage, you may discard a card from your hand to give him one shield. Just eat up cards to save him from getting hurt. Very nice. Lexi? Liam? Yeah. Whoever's next? Liam. Go. Oh. I think that's just a scout. A rebel scout. I think it is some sort of rebel scout. Yep. Literally you're called <laughs> Rebel Scout. <clears throat> scout ability upgrade. Look at your opponent's hand and discard the cheapest card from it. It's got some good dice though. It only costs one in the field. Jedi Council, Hunker Down, Natural Talent, and Negotiate. <laughs> Which is just a gun pointed to your head. I like that. Alright, Lexi's going with the next pack. Yes, yes. I can get it open. For some reason the plastic is super tough on this one. Okay. It's wherever the dice is inside the package, it like catches it. What is that? That is some sort of person, mechanic maybe or something? Smuggler? Oh, it just says black market? Yeah, black market person with a data pad. I like her coat though. Like this is actually a cool woman smuggler if for like image for concept art. You can draw two cards. You may play an upgrade from your hand, decreasing its cost by one. Comes with a daring escape. Comes with a separatist base on Mustafar. Very cool location. Lying in wait and pulling the strings. All right. So as you can see, we're getting we're getting down. We have our dice loader. Good mix. How many more packs are in here? About ten more packs. Yeah, something like that. Alright, my next pack, it looks like a flamethrower to me. Looks like it's a bounty hunter flamethrower, if I had to guess, and it is a flamethrower. Deal one damage each to up to three different characters. It's quite expensive. The best defense, backup muscle, squad tactics, and negotiate again. Alright, Liam. Liam. Here we go. I think this is Obi Wan's lightsaber. That's green, so that's definitely Luke's Return of the is Jedi it? lightsaber. If I had to guess, it is yes, Luke Skywalker's. Luke Skywalker's lightsaber will go well with our Luke. Blue character only. Give a character two shields or deal two unblockable damage to a character. It's got solid die, even though it's got a blank three. If it was two, it'd be perfect, but still. Pretty good, and it's legendary. So there's our legendary pull. Very nice, Liam. So one thing I want to note quickly too here before Lex opens the next pack is we did luckily get a nice spread here. We got Vader plus his legendary card, and then we got Luke and his legendary card. So that's just like pretty cool yeah. to note that. So um, this is going to be funny for what you just said. Here you go. Oh, it looks like a Kylo Ren lightsaber. <laughs> <laughs> All I don't think we pulled a Kylo though. Well, you I have a, get a lightsaber. Well, you do get Kylo Ren in the starter deck, which we have. So we have a Kylo Ren, and now we have Kylo Ren's lightsaber. Boom, another legendary. <laughs> Deal two damage to a character. If any of this damage is blocked by shields, reroll this die instead of removing it from your pool. Very cool, you get a second swing if they have shields up. <clears throat> cool stuff. Oh, There's those legendaries. Come on! Oh, another Rebel Trooper. Start making a Rebel Trooper Swarm deck though. He'll go along <laughs> with the Stormtrooper Swarm. There we go. Rebel Trooper again for the rare. Will Power, Cannon Fodder, Terrorism, and Block. Go. How many packs left? What, four or five packs left? There's four left. So he got another race. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. <laughs> uh, what is this? It looks like a grenade, maybe, or something. Dynamite? It is infantry grenades. Infantry grenades. That's close. 
Deal 2 damage to each of your opponent's characters. Discard this card from play for 2. It's not bad. It's not great. If they're playing a Swarm deck, it's okay. But... I want to go out on a stellar note here. Alright, this is the fourth last one. Have another. And it is an Endor speeder bike, it looks like to me. Speeder bike scout. Yes, it's a Stormtrooper speeder bike. Remove a die, you may take an additional action. Right. Oh, cool, a Saj Ventress card I've never seen. Another Moist Icely Spaceport, take cover and reposit. Liam. Are you going to pull a legendary? I'm going to try. It looks like Queen Amidala to me here. The yellow die. It's weird that she'd be yellow. But she is Padme Amidala, Queen of the Naboo. She's yellow. That's really weird that she's scum and villainy card. <laughs> Um, discard the top card of an opponent's deck and spend one resource to discard the top two cards in an opponent's deck. There's your die. Ten health. It binds all things. Backup muscle. Go for the kill and draw attention. Two packs left. Hopefully we can hit another legendary in here. Oh, uh, no. Speeder, though. Oh, another, uh... Imperial speeder bike. Oh, did you guys already have one? We just pulled it like two packs ago. Oh, my apologies. That's all right. Speeder <laughs> bike scout again. Remove a die. You may take an additional turn. We got echo base in there at least. <clears throat> and then scavenge, drudge work, and defensive stance. Lex has got the last okay, pack. Okay, the very last one. Empty. Second, second Vader. Second Vader. Come on. Ah, uh, oh, it looks like a Jedi Padawan or a Jedi Knight or Exile or something. Cool. Jedi robes. Jedi robes to equip. It's an equipment card. After you play this upgrade, give that attached character one shield or two shields if it's the first round of the game. All right, so let's recap the rares and the legendaries for you. We will be right back. Alright guys, so to recap, we got 11 red cards, we got 10 blue, 8 yellow, and 7 neutral, or equipment rather. For legendaries, we pulled Luke Skywalker, Luke Skywalker's lightsaber, Darth Vader, Force Choke, Kylo Ren's lightsaber, one with the Force. Literally every legendary we pulled was blue. So our box is totally blue. Then for non-legendaries, for yellow, we pulled Padme Amidala, Hired Gun, Django Fett, and then we pulled Jetpack Upgrade, Cunning, Flamethrower, and Infiltrate. Oh, and Black Market. For red, we pulled two Leia Organa, two Rebel Trooper, one First Order Stormtrooper, one General Veers, a DH Blaster, an IQA 11 blaster rifle, a promotion, and a TIE fighter, and a scout upgrade. For our blue non-legendaries, we pulled Count Dooku, which is our only character. Jedi robes, didn't get the Qui-Gon, I'm disappointed about that. If you have one, I'll trade you for it. Force protection, immobilize, <clears throat> and then for our gray equipment cards, we got two Ray staff, two speeder bike scouts, a Calm Link, a BB-8, and an infantry grenades. Remember guys, if you like the video and you want to see more of Star Wars Destiny, make sure to hit the like, leave a comment below, we always appreciate it, and let us know if you want to see more of this game. We're going to have some games up probably this week as well, so stay tuned for that. Take care.